is Abby with Scrap and Abby, and I'm back with another haul video for you guys. These are some items from the Target Dollar Spot, as well as a few things throughout the store itself. And then we went to um, a Harbor Freight store, and it's a tool kind of mechanic type of store. My husband needed to stop by there to pick up um, a wrench. He's working on his truck. And then I have a few things from the Dollar Tree that I grabbed yesterday. So I just kind of wanted to share these items with you guys before I got them put away. So this is one of the three-piece stationery sets from the Dollar Spot, and um, excuse me, this is the, this was from the three dollar. I have a few things that are from the three dollar spot, but it's in the in the Target Dollar Spot section, of course. So with this, you get one pen, an 80 sheet magnetic list pad, and then a hundred sheet sticky notepad. And I haven't opened these up yet, as you can see, but this is like a really pretty kind of like a lilac lavender color and it looks like it's the shape of a strawberry to me and it's got the little lines and the little ticker boxes right there or check boxes whatever you want to call them and that's the pen that comes with it and I think that's really pretty it's got the gold on the base and on the top there and then this is another one they had and this one says garden notes on the top there you can see that I like this really pretty this looks like some doodling right here I really like that and then again, this is the same sticky notes, and I love this design too. The pen is super cute. So there's that one. I was hoping to find some of the pineapple items that everybody else has been finding, but our dollar spot didn't have that yet. And this is the last one of the three-piece stationery sets, and this one's really cute too. Very springy, summery-like, you know, I like those colors. Even though I'm a purple girl, you know, I like these other colors in my crafting and planning as well. And I like that pen. That's really cute. Kind of like a, it's like an orange and kind of a light pink stripe. So that's what I got for um, as far as the three piece sets. These I'd never seen before in the dollar spot. These are three, it says three plus so jelly highlighters and it's a four pack. And you guys can obviously see the different colors in there. So I'm really excited to try these and um, see how these work in my planner. So I have a few things I'm gonna be doing as kind of like a review in my crafting. So I'm trying to keep a lot of these things to the side so I can have enough content to warrant me doing just a video of that. So I'll be sure to include that to that video. This, um, I don't believe I've ever seen these before at our Target Dollar Spot. This is a two-piece stationery set. This was in the $3 section, of course, and it's a really pretty clipboard. I like that striping on the back. And with this, you get a clipboard and an 80-sheet list pad. And we only have one. They had two of this pattern, and I only grabbed one because I was buying some other items as well. But I really like that, that black pattern and the, or excuse me, the black background with the flowers against that. I like that kind of look. So that's really cute. I like that one, too. And let's see. And then the other two things I got from the Dollar Spot are just the Mod Podge and not, nothing exciting. One is the gloss and one is the matte. I just like to always grab those when I see them. And then I decided to go ahead and try these. Um, I've seen these several different trips I've made there. This is some of the faux suede um, cording. You get five, excuse me, five, yeah, 5.27 yards total. And those are the three colors, or excuse me, five colors that you get. And I thought those would be kind of fun to play with in my crafting. And these are a dollar. I, I think what I'm going to do is um, I like to make my own journals and mini albums, things like that. So I might play with these in some of the binding that I'm going to be doing. Sorry if I sound a little bit weird when I'm talking today, you guys. I'm having quite a bit of facial pain. But I really wanted to get this um, video done so I could get these items put away. So I'm sorry for that. Um, these are some Sharpies. I love these colors. Of course, the purple's in there, but I really like these. And this Electro Pop is the theme. And I like the fine point ones like this because I use these for journaling in my crafting as well as my planner. And I'm hoping that you guys can see those really nice, pretty colors. So uh, I'll be sure to do a review on those as well. I was excited to find these. I have hauled these before um, from Target. It's the Paper Chase line, and these are the um, straws, paper straws. They were clearancing that whole entire line out. I'm trying to get this up where you guys can see it. So originally, these were $3 for a pack, which, oops, you guys saw my face, which wasn't um, bad to me in the first place, but they are clearancing these 
um, these to $1.50. So if any of you guys like that line, everything that they had, um, you know, the different coffee cups, and I'm trying to show the label so you guys can see it. It's the um, paper chase. They have, um, they have like coffee cups and they had banners and napkins and plates and some of the really cute marbly looking orange, pink and cream colored pens. So if you guys like that line, I would suggest probably going to your Target and hopefully they still have these items on clearance. Yeah, you guys can grab some of those. But I like, I wanted to grab another pack of these because, one, because they're purple. Um, but I also like it because they remind me of the Kiki K brand, that diamond that's on some of their um, different stationery. So I think these are really pretty. When I do my craft room tour, which I'm planning to do probably sometime in May because I need some time to get caught up on some project videos and things like that. I'll show you guys how I display these in my craft room. So, And then, um, of course, I had to, we went, we were walking around the whole store getting some gifts and things for family. And I went down the gift bag aisle because I like to look down there because you can obviously use gift, gift bags for more than just the intended purpose. And so I wanted to grab these two. I like these a lot. This really pretty purple chevron and white. And then this nice, it actually these are more of a, like a lavender lilac color. And then this is a polka dot one. And then here's the tissue paper. I grabbed a pack of that, which I'll probably just look at in my craft room. Yes, I'm that crazy obsessed with purple. <laughs> I have a little bit of a purple hoard section in my room where I just buy things that are purple, but I never open them or use them. So what I'm going to be doing with these is I'm going to be um, cutting these apart and then using them. And even the seam on the sides has the same pattern. And I'm going to be using these as dashboards in my planner. So even if it's a little bit too big, I can cut it down and then use them, you know, my crafting as well, run it through my die cut machine, things like that. So I wanted to grab a couple of those bags, try them out. Oh, I didn't realize I grabbed two of these, but I guess I did. I grabbed two packs of the tissue paper. This was another item that's part of that paper taste line. And this is a paper tablecloth. This was, was originally $4 and was clearance to $2. And I wanted this because I think it's, one, because it's really super pretty. I love that gold chevron with the pink and kind of that, kind of like a mint green, I guess you could say, with the gray and the white. And I grabbed that because I wanted to also use that on some crafting projects. So I'll be sure to share with you guys um, what I do with that. I'm sorry, I'm having a really difficult time talking because my face is really, really hurting. I'm so sorry, you guys. <clears throat> so this is what we picked up at, um, I'll show you the last two things I got at Target at the end of the video because I need to pick up the camera to show you. So um, this is a 25 piece storage box system. This came from Harbor Freight and you can also order from Harbor Freight online. And um, I got a three tier black display rack um, kind of tabletop type of thing like what you would find you know, like nuts and bolts and things in. I have that in my craft room. So when I do my craft room tour in May, I'll show that to you guys and be sure to point it out. I'll put a link in the description to um, Harbor Freight so you guys can check it out if you want because I like to look at the storage um, items outside of a crafting store because I really believe a lot of the big box crafting places really mark up some of the storage components because they know it's going to be um, you know, desirable by crafters. And I found that if you go to places like this, you know, your local hardware store or something like that, you can find, you know, these types of items for much cheaper than what you would find in the store. So my plan is to use this for some of my um, um, sequins. Sorry, guys. And uh, I'm going to see how that works. I like the little clear glass jars. I have them displayed in now, but, or excuse me, they're plastic, but they're, I have more, uh, than, uh, than I have of those particular clear can uh, containers. So I wanted to grab these so I could have all of my sequins in the same um, style of storage system. Plus it makes it nice and um, trans uh, transportable because I can put all my sequins back in this clear case and then I have them all together when, uh, whenever I go to a crop or something like that. So now let me share with you what I got at the Dollar Tree. Move my Target stuff out of the way. So I went there yesterday just to pick up a few um, candy items actually and um, of course I always have to check the different areas because I'm really on the hunt for that. Um, it's the Walmart or excuse me Dollar Tree branded um, deco tape and I'm really looking it's the drop brand and I'm really looking for the super thin wash that's like seven in a pack but my store didn't have that yet so I but I always like to walk around and look. So I grabbed a couple of these um, 
butterflies, and they only had two in the purple, and I think these are so beautiful. And I'm going to use this as some decor in my craft room. Really, really super pretty. So I grabbed two of those. These are just some more. This is going to be really glaring, so I'll take it off the camera in a moment. But I, these are just some more of the three-pack of the little sacks. And I showed you guys in my last um, Dollar Tree video that I got a three-pack of different purples. So this I'm going to cut apart and run through my embossing folder. I think that would be really, really pretty. And I can use it on projects, you know, canvases for mixed media um, projects or even in my planner. And then I had never seen these before at the Dollar Tree, the paper straws. This is Spring Fling. And you get 15 of these paper straws for a dollar, which I thought was a really good value. This is um, this is probably my least favorite one because I'm not a real big fan of yellow. But this has little cute pink ladybugs on it. And I thought those were really super cute. And these are kind of like a, um, oh, just kind of like a green color, almost like a tealy, Tiffany bluey type of shade with some really pretty flowers on it. How's that for a description of the color? <laughs> and these are probably my favorite. These are white with just some, um, some swirly dews and like some polka dots on it. And these were the three different um, patterns that they had. So I just grabbed one of each. And I have a really cool idea that I'm gonna be doing uh, a separate video just on this paper straw stuff. So be sure to check for that, back for that. These I've never seen before at the Dollar Tree. These were, these were new. These are some wood slice magnets and it appears to be real wood and the back has a pretty good sized magnet on there and they have them with a ton of different sayings this was the only one that was heart shaped and it says faith makes all things possible and i believe that so i wanted to grab this because i like to have positive affirmations out and about where i can see them <clears throat> dealing with my trigeminal neuralgia and my anesthesia uh, um, anesthesia dolorosa that is what causes my facial pain that I have and sometimes I have a hard time talking and it feels like I am right now anyway I like to have these kind of things around this one says you are blessed because I am very very blessed I'm extremely blessed even though I have um, a lifelong nerve disease and facial pain but um, you know I am really blessed and I like the faith because you know I have faith that one day there will be a cure for this or best case scenario i would become healed and that would be awesome so um these are the two deco tapes that i bought this pack and this pack i don't think i purchased the glittery ones before i may have i couldn't remember but i wanted to get them just in case i didn't so this is a pink and a purple and this one's a green and a purple so the brand i was looking for is the jot brand the deco tape and is the seven um, in a pack and they're like the super thin washi so I just have to keep checking back to see when they're going to get it and these I just grabbed another pack of these fastener dots and I showed these in my last target dollar spot or excuse me uh, Dollar Tree video and I wanted to grab another pack just so I could have another pack on hand so this will be part of that review video um, I was telling you guys about so the last thing I'm going to show you it's actually two things and I'm going to open one so I can bef before I pick the camera up just so you guys can see. I have shown this before, but um, and they've been out for a while, so I was really happy to see that they had a couple more, and this is what I purchased at Target. So pardon the shaky camera, you guys. I'm going to be, oops, trying to lift it up so you guys can see what I'm looking at without showing <clears throat> too much of my bedroom. Okay, so these are the containers I bought at Target, and it's Snapware Smart Store, and they have these just in the section where... They have like all of their laundry baskets and all the different storage items. And these are a really, really pretty shade of like a kind of a darker lilac-y color. I really like them. So the one I have downstairs right now, uh, right now has all of my planner stuff. Well, most of my planner stuff, not all of it, except quite a bit. That's what I use it for. So I'll be sure to share that with you guys when I do my room tour. So the lid obviously just comes off. And then what you get inside here is this really nice tray. Sorry, I'm trying to hold the camera. And um, you get to pull this out, um, and you can, you know, store all kinds of fun things in there. And then what, what else comes in here are these three different um, trays or drawers, whatever you want to call them. Now, on my first one, I have all of these pulled out, and I'm actually using these in one of my um, three-tiered 
wooden trays I have and I have different things stored in them and it looks really cute and I really like that really see-through kind of purple and I have just like all of my list pads and stuff stored up here and then on the top one I have a lot of my shorter list pads and all my page flags and stuff the, one, the ones that I get to fit anyway so I got this because I wanted to use this for more storage in my craft room because uh, part of my stuff is in the garage um, part of my crafting items and you guys will see that when I do my room tour so I'll show you that but this is really cute I liked it I believe it was $14.99 for each one which I thought was a pretty good price because you get so many different storage components in there and it snaps together like that really quick and easy and you can put some pretty heavy stuff in there because mine's full of um, like I said a bunch of list pads and stuff and it's really sturdy so that's what it looks like when you have it closed and those are all the compartments in there so I just wanted to share these items with you guys just in case you were interested in any of them and you could go to check it uh, check out your Target dollar spot and also your um, Dollar Tree but again if you guys are really interested in those um, where they go Oh, here it is. If you guys are really interested in this brand, the Paper Chase brand, then make sure you go walk around. I found these in my Target. They're on one of the end caps by the gift cards and gift bags. So if you like these kind of things, you might uh, want to go check out your Target and see it, uh, if they're on clearance or if they're already, hopefully they're not already sold out or gone by now. So anyway, thanks you guys. And um, I will be doing, let's see. Today is Wednesday, the March 30th. I plan on this weekend and then next week trying uh, to whip out a bunch of my different videos I have so I can kind of get more videos scheduled on a consistent basis for you guys. I, it just has to depend on how my face is doing. I'm not going to be able to do any today because I feel like this has been really difficult just for me to, just to talk to you guys, let alone trying to think and, you know, do the planned videos that I have on my um agenda list so i'll be getting those um uh, uh, up there and i also want to thank all of my new subbies subscribers if you don't like that word subby subby so i want to thank everybody for coming to my channel liking my videos commenting i try to get back to you guys within a timely fashion i will always always reply to you guys because i really appreciate you taking that time out to watch my video and then also to leave a comment i really love that so um yeah, I have created a few different playlists on my channel if you guys are new and you're interested to find out why I'm referencing me having difficulty talking. I have a whole brain surgery slash trigeminal neuralgia playlist and you guys can watch those videos if you'd like. It's something that's going to affect me for the rest of my life and it's always going to be um, something I have to learn to live with as I'm doing my YouTube videos because I don't want to stop doing this. This is a good healthy distraction for me and I love to craft so um, anyway I'm kind of rambling now so I'll see you guys so make sure you check back for those other videos again thanks to all my new subscribers and all of my existing ones that still continue to come back I do appreciate all of your comments and your sweet things you say about um, to me and about me so I appreciate that I'll see you guys soon have a great rest uh, rest of your week and I'll see you next time happy planning happy scrapping and happy crafting bye